everybody, it's me, Howard, and welcome back to the HR Show Experience. I'm so happy because today we are back with our, what are we on the third round now? I think so. Um, Ask Howard 3. Thank you, I'm happy you liked my videos. Um, I can't really say that I think anyone is overrated because I think that that's kind of a horrible thing to say. Because, I mean, some people might say that I'm overrated or whatever the case might be. I think people like people for different reasons and... It just so happens lots of different people like different people for different reasons. What the? I can't really say that I need anything from Sparkle because Sparkle is already going to give me everything I need. It has already given it to me pretty much because they filmed it and Whitney finished the film. That's what I needed was her to do the film and finish it so that it could go to theaters. After it goes to theaters, everything else is just good. It right is right. You know what I'm saying? And yes, I do like chocolate, but I don't really like eating just chocolate by itself. I like, um, like, our Hershey's with almonds, you know, so that you have two things, you know, the chocolate and the almonds, or Hershey's Kiss with almonds. Like, I can eat those all day. I can't really just pick five. I have to put, like, an enti the, some entire franchises in there, like, the Harry Potter franchise. My favorite out of all the Harry Potters would be like the first and the last two. But I can't really even say that fully because I love all of them. So we have to put all of them there. And then we'll put all of the Twilights in there. Because I just think Twilight is kind of interesting. And I mean, I really didn't think I was going to be into, you know, some girl falling in love with a vampire and this, that, and the fifth. But apparently I do. Now, hmm, let's see, that's two. So now we got three to go. We'll put the bodyguard in one. We'll put the preacher's wife in another. And we'll put Waiting to Exhale and Cinderella. Now, we're going to put all those Whitney Houston movies just clearly by default to get the top slots. But Waiting to Exhale and um, Cinderella go hand in hand for me because I like them for two different reasons, but they're both like really, really great. I just have to make sure that all my Whitney movies make it into the top five, but I do really enjoy Twilight and Harry Potter. My favorite time of day is any time after 1 o'clock p.m. Because, you know, that means I have slept fully. I've woken up. Yeah. And, you know, you kind of get past all the rush of everybody trying to do what they're trying to do in the morning, get to work and get into an accident or whatever. You know, you can kind of get past that whole morning rush. And then you have, you know, just the rest of the day. And I'm like a night owl. Like, I don't mind staying up for the most part. <laughs> if that is, if I've had rest previously. Well, I am already modeling. Like, I model for, like, you know, a few different photographers. I don't have, um, you know, a big-time agency, and I haven't done any campaigns, but I have done some fashion shows and things. And what's my, what's my current occupation? My current occupation is YouTube blogger, and I do music as well. But you guys haven't gotten music yet. It's coming soon. Like, the last, like, nine to five I had was, like, years ago, and... I stayed there until the building closed down. Like, if you go to my older videos and look at them, you'll see, like, me in this room, and it's, like, concrete all around, real ratchet, you know? Looks like I might have been in almost a dungeon. But I wasn't. I was at work. I was, at, I was in the projection booth at the movie theater. So, little, little tidbit. I can't say I have a favorite amusement park ride. I may have one by the time my vacation is over this year, but I don't have one right now. Um, my favorite amusement parks are like the Disney parks. So what is it? Uh, Disney, Hollywood Studios, Epcot, Di Magic Kingdom, and Disney Animal Kingdom. Uh, <laughs> um, Universal Studios, both of those parks, and SeaWorld. So all those Disney... The, all those Orlando parks, like, are my favorite parks. I haven't been to California, so I can't say anything about that. But, like, I can't wait. Like, I love those amusement parks. Like, I love amusement parks, and I love roller coasters. So, I think I just answered the question. But, side note, my birthday is in August, which is another reason why I love my Whitney so much. Because, I mean, we both in the same birth month. But, I mean, me, I am going on vacation. Well, it's not just me. It's my cousin. Um, my aunt and my best friend were all going on vacation for my cousin and I's birthday. Her birthday is the day before mine. My birthday is August 26th. And we're going to vacation down there for 10 days. It's going to be amazing. And I'm going to 
blogged about the whole thing on Twitter and, and uh, Facebook and Instagram. Instagram, mostly. Because I'm planning on taking a lot of pictures. So yeah, look forward to that. I got my cut out of Whitney from this music store. Like, the only thing they sell in there is like movies and CDs. Well, and they sell records too, but anyway, it's a music store. And I walked in there, and like y'all, I will, I don't know how I do it. I really honestly don't, which is why it's kind of weird. But I will be walking, just walking, and I'm like, stop. And I turn. And Whitney was folded in half. You wouldn't have known it was her unless you unfolded her. I reached over, and there she was. That's creepy, isn't it? Well, not creepy, but it's very intriguing. Same, slightly similar situation happened with this Sparkle soundtrack that we'll talk about in my Sparkle soundtrack review video. Um, but yes, 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 anyway. But yeah, I get a lot of my Whitney stuff that I've gotten after like my apartment burned down and everything, I had to rebuild my collection, I got from there. Now, I, I mean, you wouldn't be able to go in there and get anything because every time that there's something in there that Whitney, with Whitney, that has to do with Whitney, I already, I buy it immediately. Which is why I got this and a whole lot of other stuff I have. I kind of go a little crazy. But I mean, back to the second part of your question. How am I feeling on today? I will, I slept in late today. I slept in because I was like, oh my gosh, it's Whitney's birthday. And it kind of got me into a little bit of a funk earlier in the day. I'm trying to get over it, which is why like, I'm wearing my Whitney shirt and you know, it's happy birthday. Because normally I would have like a cake and balloons and things and I just sing happy birthday and then I would sit and eat the whole cake myself but I mean it just kind of blew my life that Whitney isn't actually alive and it's her birthday it just kind of sucks but I mean can we just have a moment of silence for Whitney first time watching me, please make sure you click that subscribe button, leave a comment down, let me know what you thought of the video, okay, thumbs up, comment, subscribe, all that, did you get it? Okay, now, make sure you go and follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash HR show, and follow me on Facebook, no, be my friend on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash HRS experience, and I'll see you next time, bye.